Let's talk about the Newton Ford Oud Mineral fragrance. I'll let you know about longevity projection, also what I think about the scent and what other people are thinking about the scent as well. First, the bottle, it's absolutely amazing. I love it. It looks like a finish on like a car or like a copper pipe. It's got a bit of patina. It's so badass and it totally gives this like manly fragrance vibes. So I'm thinking this is totally probably a masculine leaning scent, although with Tom Ford, you never know. They used to have this uh, scent in a private line, but they keep releasing them in like normal bottles now, part of the different line. So let's see if the scent is the same or is it a bit different. Man. This is so fun. It's such a interesting scent. I'm getting huge doses of like this salty aquatic minerality, a bit of this cucumber feel as well. I'll spray it again here because I've got another scent sprayed there. So I don't want to mix them. Man, it's a bit leathery. It's very fresh and cool. That's what I would say. It's cool. It smells like just stones, in the water, in the sea, and it smells like Aquaman. It's very manly, really sexy, a bit seaweed-like. It reminds me a bit of Aquamarine from Bulgari. This sort of salty marine seaweed sort of a fragrance, but it's a bit more leathery and spicy. And I would say it's got a bit more character and oomph than the aqua line from bulgari for example but i'm digging it this is a fragrance i really like it's so unusual but i could just imagine it on a guy like in the summertime if he smelled like this and not like everybody else and their duo sauvage i'll be like Whew. this guy is smelling definitely very sexy so good now let's see what other people are thinking about this fragrance i sometimes check for grantica somebody says a guy is saying i do not get this scent at all this actually smells like seagrass totally does <laughs> very intensely in the opening as it dries down seagrass is still present i don't know which universe i would find a woman or vice versa smelling of seagrass and thinks to myself mm, she smells nice that's the thing this is a fragrance for a guy though and contrary to that a woman is writing it's a winner for me. It's salty, ozonic, marine, woody, yet still clean. The sun is setting. You've been at the beach all day. Yeah, I totally get it. That's what I also said. And your skin and hair residue of all things the beach, sun and water have to offer. So this is absolutely something that she loves. So maybe like the guys are not getting it, but we as women absolutely love it. And this to me is a masculine scent like I would only see this on a, a guy to be honest I would love to smell it on my husband like this is just raw masculine but it's still got a tiny bit of that oud perfect for the summertime because you usually get those like citrusy freshies for the summertime but this is something a bit different this will definitely be a turn um head turner that's what i meant this is a scent that is definitely long lasting as well because of that wood so again a plus for like a spring summer scent that is a plus because a lot of uh, spring summer fragrances they don't last at all and i mean you want to be smelt when you wear it and the projection is also quite good it's not enormous but it is there so I mean, if you ask me, go and get it. I love it. I absolutely adore this. So let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like this new version of Oud Mineral? Subscribe if you haven't already for more men's reviews. Men's fragrance reviews. That's what I meant. For, I'll just review all men. <laughs> Subscribe for more men's fragrance reviews. See you later.